Hey, what's happening everybody? Rod J back again to take a look at another beer. Thanks for swinging by to check out another video. Today I'm actually going to take a look at one from out of Colorado and from New Belgium. This is part of their Lips of Faith series. This is actually the Flower and Citrus Ale. And this was done with New Belgium and Brower Eye Deconic. It is a collaboration beer. Comes in at 7.4% ABV. Also uh, 30 IBU. Nothing really much else on the bottle as you can see there there's kind of your main label and on the back nothing much there so let's go ahead and get this open and get it into a glass it is considered to be a uh, Belgian strong golden ale now for usually something like this I would actually use a snifter but did not feel like going to grab one and just went ahead with a pint type glass here but there we go, into the glass, actually comes out with a little bit of a haze on there, nice, uh, pretty much golden straw color, do have some clarity as the haze starts to settle a little bit, I can now see through to the other side, the head came out about finger, finger and a half, uh, has a nice foaminess on it, sits pretty much just off white, and the foam is actually starting to break down a little bit, so it should dissipate rather quickly here, get a little light behind it, you see a little bit more of the illumination. Uh, you catch a little bit of the bubble streaming, but not a lot of lively activity being seen there on the bubbles. As far as the aroma, I'm getting a nice smell of some of the yeast coming out. A little bit of a citrus from the background on the hops. Now with 30 IBU, it's not going to be heavy towards the hop air to be more of a malt type forward. But you do have to take a pretty good sniff to get it out of the glass there. I would actually expect it to be a little bit more than what's actually occurring, but it is what it is. As far as taste, interesting. So when it tastes, not really any bitterness in play at all. Carbonation sits pretty well. I get a pop in the mouth that's actually more favored to like a tart type sensation. And with it being a Belgian strong golden ale, I was not expecting to really have that tart area, but you can definitely feel it being in there. Kind of a little bit of a fruit sensation more like uh, an orange or a citrus type fruit maybe a little bit of like a lemon in there but not anything overly astringent at all it actually has a nice refreshing quality to it, it sits on the palate very well goes down easily on the back end without any burn uh, feel a little bit of carbonation in the chest but not overly carbonated but definitely feeling it some for 7.4 ABV for the body Definitely feels pretty much to be like a medium body on this one, like the medium. Not really heavy at all. I could actually see sitting out drinking this also like on a spring type day, summer type day. Um, and that, doing that with this, that ABV will probably catch up to you at some point. But it's got, like I said, a nice refreshing quality to it. You could definitely sit back and enjoy this one. Um, if you do like those little subtle type of tart type action in beers and this one, would definitely have that for you and the texture is not too bad at all not overly overly um, thin or anything like that and now I'm picking up a little bit of a what I would consider to be like a grapefruit a mild mild grapefruit type in there as well so it's got the citrus action definitely in play but um, a different type of beer a refreshing beer and uh, one that you know I would say go ahead and check out if you like those type of beers. It is what it is. The Flower Citrus Ale, Lips of Face Series, New Belgium, done with, again with Brower Eye, Deconic. So, another collab that's out there in the marketplace. If you've had this before, let me know what you think about it. Put some comments in the comment section. Love to hear any more feedback for anybody else that may have had this beer or any of the beers in this series as well. That all being said, thanks for swinging by. Check out another video. I look forward to catching you guys on the next one. Keep drinking good craft beers and cheers.